today I am going to share with you what I have been using and in full, you know, authentic sharing with you. Not gonna lie, I have been meaning to do this for like two weeks and I have now re reached the point to where my basket is so full it's quite literally overflowing. So we're gonna fly through this, but there are some really great scents in here that you guys are going to love. So let me dig in and let me go ahead and get us started. All right, guys, so here's the deal. Uh, welcome back to the channel. Um, I like to do these um, normally in a, every one week, maybe every two weeks, because I personally use a lot of Scentsy products. Okay, I use uh, the cleaning products every single night when I'm cleaning the kitchen. I use the laundry products every single time I do laundry. Bathroom cleaner, hello, cleaning the bathrooms, the soap scum on the shower door, works like a dream. Okay, so I use a lot, not to mention the wax, right? That's what I personally fell in love with when it came to Scentsy was warmers and wax. Why? Because I love fragrance and I loved the fact, this is honestly why I clicked the join button initially. I loved the fact that I could literally change the fragrance without having to go and buy a new candle or go and buy a whole new set of whatever, right? Like I could just literally change it in seconds. And I loved that concept. So, I mean, this is, this is a minute. Okay. So let me start with cashmere and corduroy. This one, oh my goodness, not only is it available in some of our body, body products, but I'm going to say this is the coziest scent ever. I love it. The cashmere and corduroy, it's just got like that soft musk and it's absolutely wonderful. All right, another new release that I warmed that I honestly wasn't sure if I was gonna like this one. It is Frosted Vanilla. Frosted Vanilla. And I was like, mm, is that gonna be like minty? Mm, let me tell you right now, it is not minty. It is very vanilla, but it has like this hint of musk that kind of gives it a good base undertone of a scent. This thing is amazing, amazing. I put this in the bedroom and I absolutely fell in love with it. Um, what else do we have? Oh, sweet orange and evergreen. So this is actually, this is the scent of the month for November, sweet orange and evergreen. So I'm gonna give you a hint. It's got some orange and it's got some evergreen. But I will say it is not an overwhelming tree scent. It does have that orange, which really balances it out. And I appreciate that because, I mean, there's times, you know, when I've got the Christmas tree up or whatever, that I want to smell that evergreen or that pine smell. And those moments are when I want a scent like that. But to not go overboard, cutting it with that orange absolutely divine. So my customers, if you guys are on my mailing list and you, you already have one coming your way. So I can't wait to hear what you guys think about it. Velvet Moon. I know I have shared this one multiple times, but hello, like this is Jackie's signature scent. <sighs> when it came out in this catalog, I was like, <laughs> For real. Uh, this is my new best friend. And let me give you, because honestly, I've been warming it so much, I honestly don't remember what the description is. So I was going to look it up. Okay, soft vanilla flower, white musk, and it says with a silky layer of foggy mist. Now, what that actually is, I don't know, but I will say it's perfection in a scent. Velvet Moon. Fantastic. Fantastic. All right. Um, oh, so, all right, I know there's going to be more of these. Wally Classified. So, we have our licensed scents, right? You guys have seen those. We've got Star Wars. We've got Marvel. We've got our, our amazing, like, Disney princesses, our villains, everything. The Wally scent. When we came out with the Wally Warmer and the Eve Scentsy Buddy, I was just in love. Wally holds a really special place in my heart and for my kids. And so, when this scent came out, I was like, oh, please like it please let me like it i love it spoiler alert it is in 
my monthly club. I get two bars of it every single month. It's that good. It's a very earthy, outdoorsy type of scent. And it literally just brightens up the entire space. And I will tell you, whenever it comes in the Scentsy Club, I get excited. And I usually end up throwing it into my wax change for that week. So, I mean, it goes fast once I get it. Um, pink Lemon Water. This one is a scent of the month from a while ago. But I really, really love it. And it has that hint of lemon in the citrus. Um, and so that is one of the reasons why I like it because it kind of brightens up. So I like to warm it by itself. I also like to throw it in with one like, for example, the sweet orange and evergreen. So throwing it into another scent like that, whether it's in the same warmer or if you, if you're like me, I, I have... I have a couple of rooms with more than two warmer than them. But like if I put this in one warmer and that in the other, like the combination, amazing, amazing. So that was a really, really good one. Um, Velvet Moon, we've discussed that. Business Casual, I think you guys know, you've probably heard me say it before. This is the one that I call my 50 Shades of Grey scent because that's exactly what it smells like. It is men's cologne my favorite again in my club so I get two of those on a regular basis um bamboo yuzu this is one that I've had in my super secret since he stashed for a while and I, I just wanted something fresh and so I wanted to just kind of throw it into the rotation this one oh it's just so good with that bamboo scent and so it's just a very fresh light airy scent and I love it I really wish that I had gotten more of those, honestly. Zeppelin, this is another one. This came out in our Bring Back My Bar when that came out. And Zeppelin, another manly scent. So you can kind of see these are the types of scents that I love. But it's that masculine musk. Yeah. Fabulous. Okay. So, and I want to say, did this one come out in the Father's Day collection? It might have. But, again, from a super secret sense of stash. Uh, red, white, and berry pie. This was a scent of the month not too long ago. I think in July or August. Mm, it's berry and it's got that almond scent. So that pie, like crust type, type of a scent. Does that make sense? Um, so it's a little bit on the food or bakery side of the world, which for me is normally not a scent that I'm going to warm a whole lot. But this one a really great combination just saying all right that one was good um lemon coconut chiffon again throwing it in digging into that super secret sash in this basket you'll see um i didn't add this to my club but honestly i'm kind of kicking myself for it mm, because that chiffon again it's almost the the coconut and the lemon are perfectly balanced in this scent and so it just honestly has a very good scent throw Again, good as a, just a space freshener. Makes the whole house smell amazing. It's very strong and I loved it. Um, Cranberry Orange Cider. This one is currently out. And I will say, I initially warmed this because I'd, I'd made some samples. And then I was like, all right, I want kind of a holiday feel right after Halloween. And so I threw this in. And let me just say, I honestly did not think I was really going to like this one. Because I thought it was going to be too much on the spicy side of the world, right? I will tell you, the cranberry mixed with that cider scent, perfection. So, uh, Jackie did order a six pack of this, so I'm gonna be keeping that in stock. I probably will, it, it actually might hit my Scentsy Club at some point, so I may have to find a rotation to put that in. Oh, there's the Wally Classified scent again. Yep, Jackie likes that one. Oh, okay, another one that is in my Scentsy Club. Um, you can still get it now. Is the Harry Potter, the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. And it's the official scent. Oh, my goodness. There's musk in this one, too. But mm, it's almost got, like, that sweet musk. It's just a very good scent and it is very neutral. And when I say neutral, I mean like this is one that's not very floral, but it's not very masculine. It's it's really right in that Goldilocks zone. So it's one that is just really potent. So when people come into my house, I love having this warming because it's one that's really gonna just hit them and 
everybody kind of loves it. So it's a very neutral scent. Love and happiness. Again, for my super secret Scentsy Sash, you can see that I've been pulling out some of these. These are ones, again, when they came out in Bring Back My Bar. Oh my gosh, this one is fabulous. And I can't remember, I cannot remember what the initial description was of it. But it's sweet and fresh and just, it's a happy scent. I, I really am. I wish I had put this in a club, but it probably got kicked out because I needed room. Uh, in all honesty, Winterberry Apple Tea. This one is definitely on my top 10 list of all time. Buy this scent in all the things. In every product that it comes in, it is fabulous. Straight up. I'm not lying. This one is amazing. You get that sweet apple. Oh, and then a little bit of like that tea or that spicy note to it, but it is fabulous in Scentsy Soak and the body line in lotion in all the things. Even in the car, I love this one in a scent circle as well. I do use a lot of scent circles in Winterberry Apple Tea. So I did pull this one out from my club, but when we get ready to change catalogs, because it's in the catalog now, right? So I was able to pull it out, but when this catalog ends, you can guarantee I'll put it back in. This is a scent that I have to have year round. So I pull it out if it comes back in the catalog, but it's never guaranteed to come back. So that's why I pull it in and out of the club. So right now it's available. I know I'm good. So I take it out and I rotate something else in. Glacier Water, this is another one. I just added this to my Scentsy Club, my monthly. This one was a scent of the month and it fresh and masculine. It's almost like that fresh laundry scent, but it's not overwhelming laundry. Okay. So uh, kind of, but that musk in the background, I want to say it had some sandalwood in it and maybe that's why I love it so much. But this one got added into my Scentsy Club because like I said, had to have it. This one's going to be a good one all year round. Loved it. Ooh, Summer Rain, that came out of my super secret Scentsy stash. This one, pretty self-explanatory. It's very, very close to Thunderstorm. This one is like you open the windows after a nice rain. Not a muggy rain, but like a cool rain. Mm, it's just that, like that fresh air scent. Oh, fabulous. I love those scents. All right, let's look and see here. Okay, I've got some scent circles here. Um, and you guys, those of you who, you know, are back and, and you know how I roll, right? I love scent circles. I use them in the vehicles all the time. I'm constantly changing them out. Um, C Cider Mill was one that I put in. I love throwing in those holiday scents. Absolutely perfect. Johnny Appleseed. This is always a fun game because when I take a scent circle out, and I'm putting a fresh one in. So when I put Johnny Appleseed in, I was taking out Glacier Water. So you get to see kind of like an evolution of what I was warming in the car. <laughs> Johnny Appleseed though is great. It's that crisp red delicious apple scent. Amazing. Glacier Water. Yeah, I told you I like it. And then Winterberry Apple Tea. Does anybody else notice a pattern in what I like? Okay. Um, oh look, Velvet Moon in the scent circle. You can see that's what I love. Cranberry... What is that? Cranberry, cran apple crumble. Sorry, cran apple crumble. This one, again, was one of those ones that I didn't know if I'd really like. I really enjoyed it. Really did. Um, and then you see I had winterberry apple tea and then went to glacier or velvet moon. Yeah, velvet moon after. That's how I roll, people. All right. Um, and I, I finally used up a brick of Skitty Dippin'. And do y'all know, notice it says Scentsy Club. I know I've got my sticker on there. But Scentsy Club right there. You can get bricks in some of our favorite Scentsy scents exclusively in Scentsy Club. That's right. You can only get them there. And this is one of those tried and true scents. I love Skinny Dippin'. It is just one of those perfect summer scents. Oh, it just reminds me of like laying out by the pool or by the water. Oh, and I love it. But it almost has like a little bit of a, not a musk, but I don't know, just like that grounding scent. So very, very good. Love, love getting through a good brick. Oh, look, another Wally classified. Okay, there we go. You see what Jackie likes. Yep, you can see it there. That's how much I love it. Oh, Speaking of thunderstorm, there was one from my super secret Scentsy stash. Yes, I got this in Scentsy Club. 
Oh, gosh, I love it. I love it so much. That fresh, outdoor, rainy scent. Ugh. All right. Uh, coming in for Halloween, I had Jack's Obsession. Hello. This one is also in my club. I believe this one's in my bi-monthly club. I get this every other month. Mm, but it's that apple cider-ness. Perfect. As we go into Christmas, I still warm this. Again, this is one that I warm year-round. Year-round. Um, feeling punchy. This one came out of the super secret since these stash is just like a fun scent to throw into a mix. Oh, it's so good though. And it's so bright. You get that nice orange mandarin kind of a scent mm, with a little bit of berry. This one. Awesome. Awesome scent. I love throwing those in when I do like a nice mix on a Saturday. Johnny Appleseed. There's that red delicious again. I'm telling you guys, when you see it in a product and you like it, remember it goes into other products, right? So you can get this in the cleaning line. I mean, I mean, just fantastic. Scent Circle. Love Johnny Appleseed. Okay. Lush Gardenia. This one came out as a super secret Scentsy stash. Had it for a while. It was time to start using it. This one, as you can imagine, smells like, oh, look, there's a little piece of wax still left in it. Just one little piece. Mm, we'll just drop that in that warmer over there. Not that I'm going to smell it, but it's a fresh bouquet of flowers. Amazing. Amazing. Love that scent. Oh, look, winterberry apple tea. Yep, there it is. That's why it's in my club. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, there's the Cran Apple Crumble. And you can see, here's the progression again. I had Scary Good in there. That one really surprised me in the scent circle. Scary Good. Didn't think I'd like it in the scent circle. Absolutely loved it. And it actually made my car smell amazing for like, I don't know. It was like a whole week. I mean, it was just strong. It was really strong in the car. Glacier Water. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, gosh, I love it. So you can kind of see what I really tend to go towards, okay? Apricot Vanilla. This one came out of my super secret Scentsy stash. This one, oh, we had it in the body products and Scentsy Soak. That's what I remember it in, in, in Scentsy Soak. Oh, amazing. So good. Apricot Vanilla, but it's that apricot, sweet apricot with just that hint of vanilla. Perfection. Perfection. All right, there's, oh, there's another Johnny Appleseed. So, yeah, there's that. Um, oh, look, another Jack's Obsession. And so you can see there's actually four different pictures or labels for those bars. So that's why it might look different. Same scent, though. Don't, don't be confused. Um, oh, and then Scary Good. Scary Good. This one actually has become one of my favorite, like, fall scents. Oh, it's just got that sweet scent of fall with the spice, like a nutty nutmeg type of a thing. All right. Um, oh, look. And then I have... Uh, uh, Madison wrote me a note. I put this here so you would get it since Dad is sleeping. Oh, I love it when she writes me a little note. Okay, so that empties the basket. Oh. I feel so good to empty the basket. All right, so those are all the scents. I wish I could pick them up and hold them so you could see them, but it would be like this. It would literally be falling over as it was out of the basket. I've been warming a lot. So how does your house smell? Does it smell good? Are you ready for a refill, right? Okay, Scentsy Club is where it's at. If you love a scent, put it in the Scentsy Club. It does not cost anything to join Scentsy Club. It literally is only perks, discounts, and allows you to always get my bar. Meaning these scents that come out or are only available for a limited time. You can add those in and get them as long or as often as you want. So there you go. There's what I've been warming. Share with me in the comments. Are you guys like me? Do you like these kinds of scents? Which ones are your favorites? I would love to hear that. All right, guys. Until next time, peace, love, happiness. Bye.